India, home to one of the largest two-wheeler markets in the world. But beneath the roar of engines, there's a problem. The lack of standardization in motorcycle workshops. Many workshops operate without adhering to a unified set of standards, leading to inconsistent service quality and safety concerns. So, how can we address this? Let's explore solutions at both micro and macro levels. On a micro level, workshops can adopt best practices from successful models in countries like Australia, USA and Canada. This includes investing in advanced tools, continuous staff training and adhering to safety protocols. On a macro level, OEM manufacturers and the government play crucial roles. OEMs can provide technical training and support to workshops. The government, on the other hand, can enforce stricter regulations and standards, similar to the Bharat Stage 6 emission standards. Let's draw parallels from other countries. In Australia, workshops must comply with the road vehicle standards legislation. In the USA, the NHTSA has established model national standards for entry-level motorcycle rider training. And in Canada, motorcycle emission standards align with the US EPA standards. Staffing needs are also crucial. Workshops need skilled mechanics and technicians, just like in any other country. Continuous training and development opportunities ensure high service quality. Standardizing motorcycle workshops in India is no small task. But with concerted efforts from workshops, OEM manufacturers and the government, it's a goal well within reach. Together, we can rev up the quality of motorcycle service in India.